Hi friends, in this video I will be sharing with you top 5 Mangal Sutra chain designs that you can consider. I find these really practical choices for brides who like something simple and more versatile. I especially love the last one, it's so unique, so stay tuned. The best part for these is these are all chains, so if you want to wear it by itself, you can and if you want to slide a pendant of your choice depending on your mood, you can do that too. Also, chain length is important to consider. So watch this video here. It will help you pick the perfect chain length for yourself. Let's start with style number one. This is the classic Mangal Sutra chain. So classic Mangal Sutra chain is a full bead Mangal Sutra chain and is made up of solid 18 karat gold. Uh, this chain is great quality and it's quite sturdy for daily wear. There's a fine detail about the hook. We use a special lobster clasp. Uh, which is uh, really comfortable to wear on a daily basis and you know sometimes your hair get entangled so with this particular clamp it's a clean design so your hair doesn't get entangled uh, in the chains anymore so who is this for this is for a woman who like black beads the look of black beads but but also for someone who loves versatile jewelry and and also for someone who who doesn't want to spend too much on the manga sutra and just need something for the wedding ceremony uh, this would be a perfect option to go for uh, for styling you can you can either wear the black beaded chain by itself or you can slide in a pendant of your choice uh, i have seen people slide in like uh, diamond solitaires or your initials for example or zodiac signs or whatever is meaningful to you at that time in your life if you recollect one of the top bollywood stars uh, deepika padukone also had a mangal sutra chain like that and she slid in a solitaire pendant uh, so it looks extremely nice style number two is our signature mangal sutra chain uh, since we've created this uh, this design it has actually gone viral and a lot of brides have been loving the look of this style uh, of Mangal Sutra chain. So this is a chain in which the black beads are just in the center. Uh, I must say this design is quite elegant for everyday wear and also you can slide in a pendant of your choice uh, if you wish to. Uh, this is a heavy chain you know this is a, this is a special chain that looks looks dainty but it's quite sturdy uh, unlike the flimsy like two or three grams gold chain. This is a solid 8 gram gold chain for a 16 inch chain length so these this is a timeless type of a chain that you will have for years to come and not something that breaks um you know with like a snap um the reason why they i i we choose to have a slightly heavier chain um because it is it lasts longer you know they they just look nicer and they feel nicer they don't don't look like a costume jewelry it is a more sturdier long lasting chain uh, styling wise, I personally see this chain to be a perfect uh, chain to wear daily at work or at parties or even at the beach. Uh, it, it will look equally great and uh, very comfortable to wear. Design number three is our Eros Mangal Sutra chain. Uh, Eros means deep love. I think this chain really represents a, a bond or a love between a husband and a wife. Uh, design wise I wanted to add some sparkle near the collarbone of this Mangal Sutra chain because normally this is the part that is seen the most when you wear any kind of a necklace or a chain. Uh, this chain has four diamonds on each side as you see and has like two black beads around it on each side. The center of the chain was left alone with the plain gold chain uh, as it looks extremely elegant. The tension needs to be on these side charms and not in the, in the middle. Uh, I absolutely love how extraordinary this piece is looking uh, and it's perfect for like a modern bride to wear on a day-to-day -day basis. Uh, who is this for? This chain is especially for women who loves uh, to add extra sparkle in their day-to-day -day jewelry and also one of my clients actually slide in uh, a minu which is like a Christian thali uh, with this chain and it looked extremely nice as well. So you can you can wear it with like other pendants or even layer it with other chains and I think it looks really good just worn by itself also. This is a very unique style and you will not get to see this very often. So design number four is our Trio Mangal Sutra chain. Uh, this particular chain is a rope style chain uh, which is finished with specially three three tones that is one is white gold, 
yellow gold and a copper tone uh, this makes this chain extremely versatile to go with any outfits or any other jewelry you're already wearing uh, also for cultural representation we have these black beads on the back of the neck so you actually don't see the black beads or when you're wearing it uh, this is a perfect chain uh, for a bride who doesn't like the look of black beads but still needs something uh, for the cultural uh, significance uh, design number five uh, so i've saved this for the last one this is truly one of my favorite designs uh, that is a timeless jewelry let's talk about the design uh, when it comes to design a uh, glamour mangal sutra chain is truly a perfect blend of trend and tradition it is designed to be a lifelong jewel that you will enjoy wearing for years to come um, it is specially designed with a sturdy gold chain and with some gold beads and black beads spaced perfectly to create an interesting pattern. Uh, I love this chain mainly because you know you don't have to slide in a pendant uh, to make it look nice. You can just wear it the way it is and it is gonna look amazing. I also think this is a perfect Mangal Sutra for someone who's already married and has a Mangal Sutra that, are, that they are unable to wear and replace it with something that is more fun and practical to wear. If you'd like to buy any of these pieces, uh, check the description below to shop. I have the names of the pieces and the link exactly next to it. So we are based in California, USA and uh, we ship to all the countries uh, like Canada, UK, Australia, India and USA. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below which style was your favorite. I would love to hear from you or if you have any other questions. And make sure you like this video and subscribe to our channel if you found this useful. Until next time, bye!